everyone and welcome to another video. Today's video I want to talk about my favourite books that I've read because of booktube. Now I've been around on booktube, maybe coming up five. I'm not sure. It's basically the longest hobby I've ever had and I'm not mad about it. So I wanted to talk about some books that I've read because of booktube. Now you can imagine with being a part of booktube, especially when it was kind of new, I saw a lot of growth in the community which has been so amazing and I've been recommended a lot of books via the comment section below, which is why I love yours comments. I've been recommended books by other people's videos, and I've also been recommended books by friends in the booktube community. So, I want to be talking about those books that I've read, and how I read them, like where the origin of me even reading them, and the little stories behind them. So I thought this would be a fun little video, very up heart, light and airy, to get going with the end of May. So this is up on my birthday today, and the reason why I wanted to put this up on my birthday is because booktube is a big, big part of my life, and I've had like three or four birthdays on booktube so yes so by saying happy birthday give this video a thumbs up comment down below if you are part of the notification squad if you want to join hit the bell button subscribe and yeah like because it really helps me out so let's get going beautiful creatures now the reason why i'm recommending this one is because this is a standout novel for me i actually found out about the booktube community through this novel itself where i had finished school and i wanted to read a book about witches and i was getting into reading and i'd never been really a big reader before and I saw the movie trailer and was like I wonder if this is a book and it was because I couldn't wait for the movie so I read the series and I actually watched videos by um I typed in beautiful creatures on YouTube to watch the trailers and of course came up with loads of people talking about it well not loads at that time only a few people were talking about it and I believe Tiernan from the booktuber he was the first guy I saw talking about this one as well as another book series so yes beautiful creatures I was recommended by actually watching a video and watching trailers and hearing what you guys said in reviews and buying it and reading it all those years ago Straight after that, I read City of Bones by Cassandra Clare because this was so big when I first started booktube. Everyone was talking about it. I believe it was Pearl and Banana Books who I saw reviewing this book for the first time and I thought to myself, I've got to read this one or maybe she'd mentioned it in a video. I can't really remember, but I just remember her being such a big fan of this series. So I was like, all right, gotta give it a go. And I did. And if you go back to my first videos ever, you will see that I actually review this series. And there we go. Bit more of a recent one, but The Crown's Game by Evelyn Scott. I saw this being recommended on Jesse the Reader's channel when he was interviewing Evelyn and I was like I've got to read that book and lo and behold I did and it's become one of my favourite books of all time so thanks Jesse for the video but yes I was recommended this through his interview with Evelyn on his YouTube during I think it was like during one of those American book festivals in the summer like a year ago maybe more than a year ago I can't remember but I just love it and I'm so so thankful I was recommended this one let me tell you another one I was recommended was The Darkest Minds by Alexandra Bracken and the reason why I'd recommended this one is because when I joined booktube it just came out and everyone was talking about it on booktube and I was like I've got to get myself into reading this one thank you so I did and now I have it and I read the whole series and I love this series but again looking at these books that I were recommended in the early days of my booktube life it really makes me nostalgic to think god guys we've come so far and so many books have come out since then but this one always fills me with that nostalgia because it just reminds me of the beginning of my booktube journey so yes this one was recommended to me by the good people on booktube thank you this one doesn't need much introduction I cannot remember who read this one and told me to read it it could have been could, could, Cat, cat from Little Book Owl. It could have been somebody else. But I just remember seeing this all over booktube and also Instagram at the time and people saying if you like City Bones you've got to read this one and it's being bought for a film. So I was like okay that's cool. Being bought for a film maybe I'll give it a check out. And I did. So yes again another one that fills me with nostalgia. I didn't read this right at the beginning of my booktube. Well maybe I did actually thinking about it. But I definitely got it really quite early on and is one that I'm glad I was recommended. Thank you. Another booktube comments recommendation was the sweet series by Kate Tiernan. This always got commented in all of my videos that I said I love because I do love any books about witches, guys. You should know this. Thank you. You should know this by now because I'm a witch. And everyone in the comments was like, you need to read the sweet series. You need to read the sweet series. I was like, what the hell is this series? Anyway, skip forward a few months. I'm in America. I see it in a secondhand bookshop. I buy it. I read it. I am thankful. It is again one of my favourite series of all time. I read the whole series and I absolutely love this series. So this was recommended thanks to the comments. I will never forget. Thank you comment for this recommendation. I appreciate you. I, another book was Half Bad by Sally Green and I actually first heard about this on Reagan's channel Proust Project and she was talking about it. It was one of her most anticipated reads and as soon as she said witches, England, modern day, kind of futuristic, I was like, Ugh! 
I need this book. Then again, it has become one of my favourite book series of all time. Everyone knows I, the love I have for Sally Green. I absolutely adore her. I've had the pleasure of meeting her loads of times and I'm so ready for your next series, Sally. But yes, this is another one which I was recommended via booktube thanks to Reagan. So if Reagan hadn't have mentioned it, who knows when I would have found out about the series and maybe I wouldn't have had that connection to it as I do now, but this is one of the standouts for me in booktube. The utter standouts. I remember it was towards the end of, I think it was like December time when her most anticipated reads of the following year video came out and I was dying with excitement. And now I have a collection of these books. Loads. Thank you. And last but not least, a, a book you could all guess is the Throne of Glass series by Sarah J Maas, recommended to me by Sasha Osberg from A Book Utopia on Booktube. Personally, to my face, via videos, constantly telling me to read this, and I did, and I'm really glad she recommended this to me, because again, another one of my favourite series of all time. All of these books I've mentioned are standouts to me that have been recommended to me via this Booktube and craziness community love. So yes, thank you Sasha for this one, because she recommended it to me, and a lot of comments as well, a lot of you in the comments, how have you not read Sarah J Maas? And it was one of the first arcs I was sent as well, was the Sarah J Maas series, and I still hadn't read it, and I watched her be this small author that nobody really read, and now this big, big author that, like, everyone's read like yeah love so there you have it there all the books that i'm talking about in this books that were recommended to me via booktube video i hope you guys enjoyed let me know in the comments down below one book that you have read being a watcher i can guess you guys have read loads of books thanks to booktube but yes i have to admit uh, the majority of my shelves are thanks to booktube so thank you booktube thank you thank you thank you and apart from that i'll see you all again very very soon for another video have a lovely lovely day and i'll see you in june bye